guys uh, welcome to top phone for you in today's video i've got the xiaomi mix 4 and um, i've uh, flashed uh, the rom from xiaomi.eu forum and uh, a new update just uh, popped up i'm just gonna show you how you can uh, install uh, the update there is a uh, two way you can uh, download the update by going to the my device and then update and then download it direct to the device or you can just uh, go onto the xiaomi.eu website uh, from your laptop or computer and then go onto the MIUI uh, stable row and then scroll down and then you can use uh, any of these two links uh, to download the ROM and then from here you just find the latest uh, Xiaomi Mix 4 updates. So the latest version is the version 12.5.12 12, uh, and it's the zip uh, file. And uh, in here if you check the, the version I have installed on the phone is uh, the version 12.5.9. And so uh, that's uh, the latest version. You uh, just uh, click on the file and it will start downloading. Because I've already downloaded it, I'm not going to do it again. Or if you download it direct on the phone, uh, that's fine. And then the next thing, uh, you need to go onto my website and download uh, the TWRP recovery with the ADB file. So just go onto www.topphone4u.com. And then go onto the tutorial section. And then close uh, any advert. On the first uh, video for the Xiaomi Mix 4, just click on here to download uh, the TWRP recovery. And then once you download it, uh, if you go into the download folder, you get these two files. It is the only file you're going to need. But um, So uh, first, just uh, copy the ROM into the phone if you download it on your computer or if you download it directly to the phone then you don't need to do this step but because i don't have it on the phone i'm just gonna copy over just do file transfer when you connect the phone now just uh, open the computer and then go onto this device and then internal storage i'm just gonna need to copy the ROM I downloaded to this uh, folder. So I'm just gonna right click. Right click. Copy. And then this is the phone itself. Just gonna right click and then paste, and that's copying the ROM I downloaded from the Xiaomi.eu forum into the internal storage of the phone. Okay, once uh, that uh, file has uh, completed copying over, just uh, close this, and now I just need to right click on the minimal ADB fastboot, and then extract file. Then OK. Now open the extracted folder. Inside the folder, need to install the minimal ADB fastboot to just uh, double click on it. And then yes. Just do next, 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 next. And then tick create desktop icon and then finish and then install. So untick this because I don't want to launch the app now. So just uh, click on finish. The next things you need to do, just open the TWRP recovery and then right click on the TWRP.IMG. If it's showing just a TWRP on its own, don't worry, it will be the same. You just need to click on view and then take that file name extension and then it will show the .IMG extension right click and then copy and then go to the icon on the desktop right click and then open file location and then right click on this folder and then paste the image for the twrp and then you just uh, click on continue 
once uh, you do that um, you need uh, now just close these two you don't need them just double click uh, on the icon on the desktop now and then it would open up with the minimal adb fastball okay just to double check uh, that your device is connected uh, properly to the laptop and it has uh, all the fastboot uh, and then and the adb driver installed you need to type in this command uh, devices so this will display any device your fastboot devices connected on your laptop or pc so when you press enter Oh, um, it's not sure because the phone is not in fast but now I'm just gonna switch off the phone I'm just gonna unplug the cable first and then switch off the phone once the phone is completely off I'll put it into fast boot mode press the volume down while you power on And then now uh, plug the phone in. And now if I type in that command again, as for devices, and then press enter, it will show the device there. If it doesn't show, uh, it means you don't have the correct driver installed. You have to go on my first video, which shows how you can install the driver before you carry on. So once you have uh, the device uh, display there, it means everything is good to move on to the next step. So you just need to type in this command to flash uh, the recovery uh, to this phone. So you just type fastboot flash recovery twrp.img which is the file you copy into the recovery folder and then press enter and then you just need to type in uh, this command to put the phone into recovery mode just do What this command does, it will reboot the phone into TWRP recovery. So just uh, tap enter. And the phone will restart. As you can see there, it will just uh, reboot into recovery. And then from here, you can just uh, disconnect the phone and then proceed on the phone. Okay, now uh, all you need to do, uh, just uh, tap on the free button on the right and then go to the little circle on the top right and then change the language to English and then tap on the bottom. And then uh, next you need to go to advance and then uh, tap on this one key inject to TWRP. What this does, it would uh, install the uh, TWRP recovery onto the device and make it default. Instead of having to plug it into your computer every time you wanna put it into recovery. So just tap on it and then slide this to the right to start the install. Just uh, give it a few minutes. Okay, once uh, that's done, just uh, go back. So now uh, you have uh, flash the TWRP recovery. You're good to proceed and uh, install the updates. So uh, next, what you need to do, just tap on install and then scroll down and you'll see the ROM you downloaded. Just uh, select it and then swipe this uh, to the right to uh, perform the uh, update. So I'm just gonna swipe this to the right to start the update process.
Okay, the installing process has uh, finished. So uh, the next thing you need to do, you just need to wipe it down a bit. To wipe the cache. And then now I can just do a reboot system. Okay, now the phone is back on. Uh, let's uh, make sure the see all the apps are still there. So I can just go to the settings and then my device. And then as you can see, the ROM has been updated to the latest version 12.5.12. Next time there is a new update, you don't have to install TWRP again. It will still be on this phone. So all you need to do is just download it from the phone. And then uh, you just need to power off the phone after you downloaded the update to the phone. And uh, to put the phone into recovery, you need to press the volume up. Now the volume down will put it to fast boot board and volume up will put it into recovery. Just press volume up while you power on. And there you go. So you have a TWRP recovery on it. And you can just uh, install and then uh, browse to the a file you download it and then perform the update as normal you don't need to connect it to the computer to install twrp again okay that's it from me and um, if you enjoyed this video give us a, a thumbs up and don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you're new to my channel and uh, enable notification for my latest video thank you for watching stay safe and i'll see you on the next one